Hi Glam Fam, welcome back to my channel and this is the makeup look we are going to be doing today. And I'm starting off with scotch tape just to give my eyes a nice elongated cat eye look slash non-surgical facial lift. So I'm just placing it on the outer part of my eye going up towards my eyebrow. And the first color I'm going in with is Treasure from Anastasia's Self Made Palette. And I'm just using it as a brow bone highlight. And I'm using a fluffy brush. And I'm taking my Morphe Single Eyeshadows in Caramelized and Deep Skin. And I'm just starting from my outer V and going inwards. Which this is going to be acting as my transition color. Next, I'm going in with the same brush and Anastasia's self-made palette. I'm going in with Hot Budge. And I'm taking that on my outer V and I'm just working my way into my crease. Packing on the most on the outer and blending out the rest throughout my eye. Next, I'm going in with a flat eyeshadow brush and I'm going in with my e.l.f. black liner and that will be acting as a nice base um, when I put on my gl black glittery pigment on my eye and it will intensify it more. But I'm going to be setting it with a powder as well but I'll be placing um, a little bit of gel liner and then smudging it into my lower crease now I'm going in with spirit rock from Anastasia and I'll be setting that black gel liner that I just laid down on my lid and it looks messy now but I promise you ladies and gents that it will look flawless at the end result now I'm taking secretive caramelized and deep skin and I'm just taking that into my crease just to make sure I have a flawless blend with the black and the browns and I'm just going in with the same browns just blending out any harsh lines to make sure everything looks nice and cohesive now I'm taking my ColourPop Cosmetics um, Shadow Shock in Get Lucky and I am going to be placing that on my brow bone and now I'm taking Caramelize just to blend a little bit more now I'm taking Shameless, which is the star of the show. It's this black um, based um, pigment with teal green glitters in it. How beautiful is it? So I'm just taking it, I'm just placing my Shameless eyeshadow where I placed my black gel liner and um, black um, eyeshadow. And I'm just bringing it a little tad bit up on top of the crease, just a little bit. And now I'm taking from my inner corners a pencil brush and get lucky again just to highlight the inner corners to brighten them up a little bit. And now remove the tape nicely. And now if you have any fallout, you can go ahead with a makeup remover wipe. And the one I'm using is my um, washcloth, my makeup remover, um, what do you call those things? Makeup eraser, yes. Okay, <laughs> had a slow moment. Now I'm going in with Elf's black liner again, and I'm just placing that in my waterline just to intensify it a little bit more. And I'm taking that on my lower lash line as well to smoke it out. Everything I did on the top, I will be doing on the bottom as well. Now to smudge it out, I'm using a clean pencil brush with no extra product and just blending. Now I'm taking Spirit Rock, which is this black eyeshadow with hints of glitter in, from Anastasia's self-made palette. And I'm just pressing it into the gel liner we placed on our, on our lower lash line. And now I'm taking a nice detailed synthetic brush and I will be placing Shameless from ColourPop Cosmetics on my lower lash line on top of the black eyeshadow that we just finished putting on.
Now, just to crisp it up and make sure everything is neat, you could go with a makeup remover wipe and just crisp up any um, little uh, mistakes or whatnot. And now I'm going with a fluffy brush and taking caramelized and deep skin. And just to blend out the black eyeshadow, I'm using those two colors to soften it up a little bit. Now I'm going in with my mascara, preparing my lashes for some falsies. And the bottom as well, you want to apply some mascara. And onto lashes, my favorite lashes from Lily Galici. Um, they are the Mykonos, Mykonos, and uh, they're very dramatic, they are very beautiful, and they complement this eye look a lot. And this is the finished look. I will finish my makeup, and here it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And yeah, I see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Mwah. Oh, and another thing, I was feeling myself a little way too much and I forgot to tell you guys that everything I used will be in the description box down below and um, let me know what you guys think of this makeup look, you know? Um, I would love to hear your feedback and yeah, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, comment on the um, comments down below. Follow me on all my social media. I'll follow you guys back. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye. Jack it up.